But first, Matt Petrillo is live at Hahnemann University Hospital, where workers and patients are wondering what comes next. Matt? Yeah, this is a really big upset for the whole Hahnemann community here in Center City. And we just learned new information. KYW News Radio obtained a strongly worded letter sent by Philadelphia Mayor Jim Kenney to the president of the parent company of Hahnemann University Hospital. It says that if the hospital abruptly closes, like the city has learned, then that violates city charter. It also contradicts information that the hospital sent in a news release. I like the doctors. There doesn't seem to be a minute when a patient isn't walking through the door here at Hahnemann uh -huh. University Hospital's main entrance. I come here to get an injection. I came today for a checkup. But Hahnemann's parent company president, Joel Friedman, said in a statement today it's closing its doors for good in early September, adding, we are faced with the heartbreaking reality that Hahnemann cannot continue to lose millions of dollars each month and remain in business. We want to keep the uh, emergency room open. It's important. Philly Mayor Jim Kenney even says the city tried to keep the hospital open. City leaders have been working with its president, Joel Friedman, for the past three months, but... He's not been forthcoming with a lot of the financial information that allow us to plan. The governor's office told us a similar story. So did Hahnemann's yeah, Nurses Union. We've also requested information from the hospital, which it has not provided us with. We also just learned Hahnemann's news release about its September 6 closing was not as forthcoming as its actual plans. KYW News Radio obtained a letter from Mayor Jim Kenney sent to the president of Hahnemann's parent company. It says the hospital plans to stop emergency services effective Monday. Kenney says if that happens, it violates city regulations, adding, this is unacceptable short notice. Please assure us in writing by 10 a.m. tomorrow that you will not end or decrease emergency services before July 12th. And so right now, the city is still waiting for a response from Hahnemann University Hospital. Meantime, the state tells us that it requires a 90-day notice of a closure of a big company, one like Hahnemann University Hospital, where 2,500 jobs are at stake. And so far, the state tells us it has not received any response. We are working to learn that if the hospital plans to send that at all, keep us, we'll keep you posted on our website, cbsphilly.com. Reporting live in Center City, Matt Petrillo, CBS. Three Eyewitness News. All right, Matt, thank you.